Alright guys, it took a second for the audio to fix itself, but oh my god. Hey, what is going on everybody? My name is Dan. Welcome back to another episode of Super Mario Modesty. Today, man, the modding community continues to outdo itself, guys, because today we are playing a completely redesigned high quality version of bub on battlefield that was created by the sun cat his social media his youtube as well as the download link for this model will be linked down below i'm also using this yoshi outfit model swap that was made by crafty boss that i showed off in yesterday's video make sure you guys go and check that video out up in the i card if you want to make sure or if you want to go and check that out but man this is crazy dude i'm actually so excited so as far as i know right his video doesn't show exactly where the uh where the actual level is however if you guys use your memory okay you might realize maybe he put it exactly where it was back in the day back 22 years ago when uh, when super mario 64 first came out we see this pipe that was not here earlier before i installed this mod so let's go down this pipe and see what is down here so we can see oh guys we're gonna jump through this painting and be in bob bomb battlefield let's do it all right guys it took a second for the audio to fix itself but oh my god this is the most oh my god i gotta turn my my sound down okay like this is the most well look like this is the best looking odyssey level just by coming into it that i've seen so far like at all whatsoever I know Suncat has spent a lot of time working on this. He even went out of the way to make sure we can't just walk out and escape the level. So from what I'm aware, there's actually 10 moons in bob -omb Battlefield. This is freaking crazy, man. There's purple coins and the whole thing. Oh, these are all the uh, the Mushroom Cannon purple coins. Okay. Click some of these purple coins. Now, I wonder, did he put the moons where the stars normally are? <gasps> he did! Oh my god, Suncat, you did not go all out like this oh my god sun cat i'm shaking behind the chain chomps gate i think he actually put moons where the original moons were dude i think he might have actually done it maybe not for all of them but let me go ahead and run around a little bit and see what all is in here oh my gosh we got something we can ground pound onto here it's a star it's a star my gosh remains of an old cannon this one is called See, we got another one over here. I think maybe if we stomp these guys in, maybe we get another moon or star or whatever. The music in the background, dude, just, oh, it's incredible, bro. Now, I've been very vocal in saying that I have not been the biggest fan of Mario 64. However, the biggest issue I had with that game was its controls. I think that its environments are absolutely incredible. So, for us to have this now, just, oh my gosh. This is so incredibly well done. Like, I'm honestly, dude, I'm at a loss for words. Like, I almost, like, I just, I almost don't know what to say. I've always known Suncat to be a talented level creator, man. Completely, like, just a, a, a skilled individual who has a lot of passion for what he works on. But this is completely, like, like, there's a chest and there's glide on over here and... There's a star completely just destroying expectations here, dude. Shoot to the island in the sky was the name of that one. So there's... Wait, do we have to go through these rings? Wait, do we need to get all these? Hold on, let me hit this swing real fast. Hold up. What do you do? Yeet. Oh, you do not go to the same place. Okay. Whoa. Let's go to the summit, boys. Let's see what's up there, man. I want to see what's actually at the top of uh, the mountain that's here on bub -Bum Battlefield. I... I... Wow, okay. Let's see what's... I'm just so excited. Can you tell? Ba-da-bum. Ba-da-bum. There's little bombs, like the little balls rolling around to the little boulders. Dude, the attention to detail here is crazy. Guys, make sure you guys check the link in the description, man, and let Suncat know that he has made just like that he's done awesome work, guys. Oh, what's this? I just blow all these guys up. Boop. Boop. And then just ground pound on you. And then a star comes out. Okay. Now, if I were a star, where would I be? Oh, I see Scarecrow over here. Let's go get that Scarecrow real fast. Oh, we got something over here. Is this one? That's another star. 
Let's go, dude. All right, now I want to see. I think this is going to be a Scarecrow timer challenge. Homie, no. Wait, are you for real, dog? We got to go all the way up there? Wait. Oh, here it is. Okay. Whew. I thought the timer was going to be really... Like, I thought it was going to be, like, a com like completely unfair, but I'm absolutely surprised. Oh, wait. Oh, maybe it isn't, like, a timer. Maybe it's just, like, you just don't get to use your cap. You have to go back down and go get your cap. Okay. Guys, I know I've said this already. Make sure you guys go down in the, the description. Go find the Suncats link and go show the man some support, man. Go sub to his channel. He's making a bunch of awesome stuff, man. Like, this is just insane, dude. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and grab all the purple coins out of here. Because if I remember correctly, I think that you have to collect red coins normally in SM64. So I'm going to just go ahead and grab all of the uh, the purple coins that are hanging out. Maybe a moon will appear. You never know. It's worth a try, you know what I'm saying? Now this guy over here. Okay, so for one thing, there's a purple coin right there. Oh, okay, so there's a uh, there's a Goomba thing right there. So luckily we can just grab this guy right here. I'm going to go ahead and get this Goomba stack real fast because I think this is going to be a moon. How many goes do I need? I need 10. Where am I going to get all the Goombas from? Let me think this out for a second. Obviously, I understand you could, like he couldn't make every single challenge from Super Mario 64. You know what I'm saying? So like I totally get that. This is like the the stuff that he replaced it with. You know, like put in place of it. Like is equally. I feel like this is like this could genuinely be like a first party, like a first party game. This could legitimately be like a first party game. Like I feel like you could tell me that this would be like first that this was a first party Nintendo release. And I might believe you. There's a pretty solid chance that I would believe you. Right, how many do I have in here? Oh, I have six on here, so I've got all ten. I just have to, like, stack them up and then bring them back over. I will say, also, big props for him, like, getting the music to work all the way through. A lot of other levels that we've played uh, recently have had, like, the music that's been there. And then what typically happens is that, like, the music will just stop after a while. And that's a star. Stack O Goomba. Let's ground pound so we can just kill them all in one swoop. Ah... So satisfying. All right, I haven't done anything with this glide on yet, so. Got that, and then there's a star right there. All right, there's another one. Dude, I'm honestly like, this is it's such an experience, man. If you guys have modded switches, dog, like, you have to play this. Wait, does this thing spin? Oh, I thought it would spin around for some reason. I don't know why I thought it would spin, but I thought it was going to spin. All right, so there's two more that I need. I'm pretty sure, I'm like 99% sure... One of them has to do with the purple coins that I have, like, not really collected all the way. Make sure there's nothing here in this, uh... Alright, there's nothing in there. Cool. Second, like, it would be like Sunkai is like, let me hide something in the crevice, you know? So, yeah, I see a purple coin up in that tree. Didn't grab that. Just trying to, like, get an idea, like, get a little bit of a... Of a high point. So that I can see, like, what I might be missing. That's just, like, too high for me to see from the ground level. Right? So, like... I wouldn't have thought to look in this tree whatsoever. Would have just completely forgot about it. And then there's another moon. Okay. All right, so that moon's over there. Let's go ahead and go grab that real fast. All right, so there's one more moon that we need to find. So let's uh, run around for roughly 20 minutes and uh, see if I can find it. Ah. Well, this makes sense. Seems that there's a, uh, there's a moon in my rock. Hey, there it is. And that's the last one. Before we grab that, though, I do want to just kind of explore around for just a minute. Just get an idea of how much detail is in this. These floating platforms, it's cool, yes, the floating platforms here. They are a little bit disaligned, but it really isn't that big of a deal in all honesty. But before we even do that, I want to see if there's any way we can get out of the map. The walls look really tall, but of course we have Cappy, so maybe there is a way for us to find our way out. It looks like it's just tall enough to keep us in, dude. We can't get out. <laughs> There's no escape. Oh, this is going to be it. There's an invisible wall. That's what I wanted to know. Was there an invisible wall? Could we get out of the map? Turns out there is indeed an invisible wall. Let's go ahead and head on over here. Collect this final moon. Star thing. Kick it, break it. And let's head on out of here. Guys, this is an absolutely incredible piece of work by the Suncat, guys. Again, 
social media, his YouTube, the download link, Crafty Boss's amazing freaking Yoshi skin, uh, costume, whatever. Guys, I'll, I'll go down to, <laughs> down in the description. Go support all of them, guys. They're doing incredible work. They need your support, man. They deserve all the love and support from my community as well as everybody else in the Odyssey community. So go show them love and yeah, tell them Dan sent you. Right, guys that is going to conclude my video for today i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did make sure you drop a like on the stream on the stream on the video if you really enjoyed it make sure you guys hit that subscribe button turn on post notifications so you never miss one of my videos and i'll see all of you guys in the next video bye everybody